We give Muslims a lot of flack for Aisha being 6 when Muhammad married her and 9 when he deflowered her, but the rampant child marriage that goes on in Hinduism makes Islam look not so bad, and that's hard to do. Not only does India, a country predominantly Hindu, have the largest percentage of child brides in the world, child marriage is encouraged and widespread all throughout the Hindu scriptures. Let's start in the Padma Purana. A man should marry his daughter as long as she has not attained puberty. Wise men recommend a girl's marriage when she is 8 years old. Wise men get married their unmarried daughters as long as she does not menstruate, does not attain puberty. The father should keep his daughter in his house till she becomes 8 years old. He should not keep a strong grown-up one. Both the parents get the fruit of the sin which a daughter living in her father's house commits. This is only the tip of the iceberg. There are scriptures that speak of marrying a child while she is an infant roaming around the house naked. Let him give his daughter while she still goes naked to a man who has not broken the vow of chastity and who possesses good qualities or even one destitute of good qualities. Let him not keep the maiden in his house after she has reached the age of puberty. This is further mentioned in the Vashista Dharma Sutra. Out of fear of the appearance of the menses, let the father marry his daughter while she still runs about naked, for if she stays in the house after the age of puberty, sin falls on the father. Also the Gautama Dharma Sutra. A girl should be given in marriage before she attains the age of puberty. Brahma Vaivarta Purana mentions that marrying a girl child leads to blessings from the goddess Durga. Whoever having decorated his virgin daughter aged 8 years with apparel reverentially makes a gift of her to a good Brahman, reaps the benefit of the gift of the goddess Durga. It only keeps getting worse. The great Hindu epic of Mahabharata mentions the following. A person 30 years of age should wed a girl of 10 years of age called Anagnika, or a person of 1 and 20 years of age should wed a girl of 7 years of age. And there are many many more in the existing Hindu texts, yet Hindus will complain that this is a western conspiracy to spread Hindu phobia. But your own scriptures confirm this and the facts do not lie. Child marriage is an inseparable part of Hinduism. Muslims, I think you've found an unholy alliance.